Hello everybody, this is Rodrigo and Wendy from Charlotte, North Carolina. And we're so excited to be part of this online congress sponsored by G. Franco. Today we're going to do bachata footwork. Okay, we're going to get started with a, with a warm up and then we'll go from there. So, let's go. Every other, every other beat with the second step. Mm -hmm. um, there's another type of count is uh, syncopated. Okay, the syncopated count we step in between each beat, so it makes it faster. One and two and three, five and six and seven. Okay, so from one basic and then into the syncopation. Basic one, two, three, tap, five, six, syncopation. One and two and three, tap, five and six and seven, tap back to basic, two, three. Corby, we're gonna do one, three, five, basic. One, two, three, tap, five, syncopation, jump. One and two and three, tap, five and six and seven, back to the basic. Two and three and five, six, seven. Yes? Okay. So facing you, we're gonna be like this. Basic, one, two, three, four, 
five, six, and we'll go into the Kirby. One, three, five, seven, back to basic. Two, three, single patient. One and two and three, tap. Five and six and seven, tap and basic. Two, three, and five, six, seven. All right, guys. So now let's get into our footwork that we have. Please. Yes, let's go. First thing, first off, this is how we do it. For our basic, one, two, three, and four. Okay? So I'm going to take the steps. One, two, three. Three, replace and open. This will be a single patient, okay? One, two, three, and four. From this position, I'm gonna cross. Continue on single patient. Five and six, seven and eight, okay? One more time. One, two, three, and four. Five and six, seven and eight, okay? Releasing our left leg. Weight is so on the right. Again, ready to go on the one, okay? So remember that Facing you. on the first part is kind of like that, like it's my right leg does this to the left leg. One, two, three, and four. I replace my my uh, right leg with the left. See that? So I push the, the left, left out, okay? So I place the left with the right. Yes. Pushing it. Mm -hmm. So do a face, face the front. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, and four. Five and six. Seven and eight. Okay, very good. From here, so one more, one more, and then continue. Mm -hmm. Eight, one, two, three, and four, five and six, seven and eight. With the left leg, go forward. One and two and three and four. Okay, so another uh, single patient. Leg forward. One and two and three and four. Okay? Okay. So we have one, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight, one, and two, and three, and four. All syncopation. So count out loud with us. One, and two, and three, and four. Okay? So that's the second step. So we do one, and two, and three, and four. Okay? Like a, a, like a double step at the end. Okay? So single, single, double. Mm -hmm. So count it out loud so we can learn it better, okay? So we can hear you. Everyone, count out loud. Five, six, seven, and. One, and. Three, and four. Louder, louder, okay? E. One. Okay, now we'll join your count one last time. Five, six, seven, and. One, and, and two, and three, and, three and, and four. Okay? okay? So from here, we're going to go into a left turn. Step on five. Step on six. six. Do a little rulo. Seven. Eight. Okay? This leg movement that he talks about is called a curl. Like a hair curl. See that? Like when you do that to your hair. It's like doing a little something, something for your hair. <laughs> See that? Un rulo. Okay? okay. Make, it, here. make it pretty. Okay? So, let's back up one uh -huh. second. So we do one and two and three and four, then five, six, seven, eight. That's it. Okay? Let's count it one more time from the top. We'll drill it a couple times and then we'll try it with basic. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. One and two and three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Rulo is optional, okay? <laughs> All right. Okay, one more time. Let's do it with a basic so we get comfortable with that and then we'll do the sequence. And then with music. And then with music. Five, six, seven, basic. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. One, and two, and three, and four. Five, six, seven, and eight. Very good, you guys. Okay. Music. Now, with music. Okay. Oh. Yeah, the Please don't be spared. 
besos y me los devuelves Así tengo una excusa para volver a verte Yo no te pido que te enamores Seamos eternos, solo hasta lo que Yo no te pido que seamos novias Si siendo amigos ya no estamos de todo Amigos con derecho Slow music uh -huh. first to take it comfortable with the step and then gradually start making it a little bit faster. Exactly. Okay? Exactly. Okay, so let's move on to the next type of count. Any questions? No? Good. Continue. So we finish with the five, six, seven, eight. Okay? What we're gonna do is that we start taking steps back. One, two, Three, tap. Five and six and seven, tap. Or set. Okay, that's how we switch our base. One time. So we finish here on eight. We're gonna set back. One, two, three, tap. Open and cross and open and together. Switching the way. Okay? Very good. Last time. So we finish here on eight. Eight, back, one, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, eight. And let's okay. All right, okay. So we're gonna start from there. Let's take it one before, so we can start like gluing everything together, okay? So we're gonna do one, eight, two, eight, three, eight, four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, Five and six and seven, eight. Releasing your weight so we're back on the one with the left. Okay, yep. one more time. Five, six, ready, and go front, back, front, and front. Step, around, roll on, step, back, 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 tap, open and cross and open and down. Very good, okay? Um, yes, yeah, so details. Remember that. Uh, come close. <laughs> All right, so remember that the feet have to make sense. If you're having trouble with like getting there, it might be because of the switch of weight. So make sure that you practice this movement that we were practicing in warm up. So whenever we do step and, see that? I'm switching my weight every time. And when we do the, the rulo, um, my weight is on my left, so I can, I'm available to do that little stirring from the knee, yeah? So I'm able to do that, and then I can step because I'm going from one foot to the other, okay? okay. So, you're not gonna have a, a, a lot of time to step on the eight, so as soon as you finish, 
with the ruler here, transfer, eight, only as a tap. Uh -huh. And pass the leg again. One, two, three, tap. Okay? Five and six and seven, tap. Now, one tip so you can get faster on your footwork, we have to hover. So notice how Rodrigo, if you're facing, if you're facing you, he's facing you, when he does the five and six and seven, Mm-hmm. Okay, so then go into the last step. One, two, three, tap. Look how, uh, how he hovers on this point here. Okay, so it's open and cross and open and tap. So you see, that gives him a lot of control of his feet that he can be really fast here versus just tilting a little bit back and having our uh, most of our weight on our heels is harder to control the feet. It's going to so, take you longer. So practice hovering, like if you're looking at your toes. See that? I look. I see my toes. Okay. So here, I I can do that because I'm able to switch way faster. Okay. That's a good tip to practice. And another one, if if you wanna work on faster footwork, mm -hmm. the idea is to make them smaller. Yes. Okay. It gives control. you more time. Control. It gives you control. Um, it makes sure that you are doing the step correctly, and it gives you that strength that we need in the legs. Okay. Yeah. Very good. So, let's do it from the top one time and then we'll add one more count. Go. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. One, and two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, and eight. Very good. Okay. You okay to move on? Do I do it one more time? We should do it one more time, right? Five, six, three, right away. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. One, and two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, and eight. Back to and I'm available on the one with the left, okay? Don't forget. Music. Um, oh no. We should do one more. Okay. Let's move on. So we finish on the five and six and seven, eight. So we're gonna do a heel toe step. One and two, three and four. Okay? One and two, three and four. Okay, again, single patient on the one, three, and four. E, heel toe step, 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 step. Okay? From here, we're gonna go forward to a left turn. Forward left turn, seven, eight. And we drop on eight. the eight, so we can really accent that. Make that accent, okay? Up. So it's gonna be counted. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Not only does the drop help you with accent, but it also helps you release the weight. So again, we're back into our left answer one. Okay, so you're facing here. So you're gonna be. I'll face that way so they can see both sides. Okay, it's gonna be one and two, three and four. Turn, six, seven, eight. Weight again goes to the right leg, left is available for the next part. Okay, so notice too that on this step is a very heavy step on the two. So look at this. One and two. Put your weight on it. See, very heavy step on the two, okay? Same thing here. Three and four. On the four, very heavy. So then you release the leg. Five, Five six, six, seven, seven eight. eight. Very nice and clean, okay? Yes. Let's uh, take it from one before, and then we'll do this one. Ready? And one, two, three, four, Five and six and seven eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One more time, please. So for the eight, mm -hmm. there we go. One, two, three, four, five and six and seven, eight. One and two, three and four, turn, six, seven, eight. Very good. Let's face them, I'll face the other side. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, eight. One and two, hover three and four, turn six, seven, eight. 
Did you see everybody covering? No. There was one okay, now, of okay, you. Now, now, now one of you is not hovering. Let's do it one more time. Let me face them. Now. Five, six, seven, back. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, and one, and two. Continue. Three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. Okay. With music that? or one pound and then with music? Oh. Okay. Let's do the whole thing with pounds. Practice your counting. It goes a long Count way. Count it out loud. Yes. Okay. With us. And then? Outside voices. Okay. And then we'll do it with music. Okay. Five, six. Five, six, seven, E. One. Go. Three and four. Five and six. Seven and eight. One and two and three and four. Five, six, seven, E. One, two, three, four. Five and six and seven, eight. One and two, three and four. Five, six, seven, eight. One more time for me, okay? One more time because of Wendy. <laughs> Let's go. When you count. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, and four. Five, and six, seven, and eight. One, and two, and three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. Back, two, three, jump. Five, and six, and seven, eight. One, and two, three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. Woo! Woo. Music.
hover. We talked about that earlier. We also think it's very important to have flexible knees, okay? Whenever we switch the weight from one leg to the other, it allows us to move our hips, which gives us the movement for bachata. So, see how I am a little bit bent, a little bit, and then whenever I do the basic, I'm able to transfer that weight. So then the essence of bachata is right there with us, okay? See how he switches the weight? Okay, practice that. A good, a good exercise to practice is just going from one shift the weight leg to the other. Okay, okay. and you can use this also with merengue. Merengue you is exactly merengue. the same thing, exactly. Ah, and shift and shift and shift. Takata, takata. Okay. Ta. Maria, we, Maria, se fue. We don't want to look too, um, too stiff. No. Okay, that can easily happen when we focus so much on what we have to do with the feet. Then we forget the movement. See, this is the same thing, but no movement. Okay, but if you go down a little bit, all of this is gonna become so much better for us, for you, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Should we move on? Yes. All right. Huh? Let's see, where we at? So we finish into the turn, 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 pa. Okay? Now we're gonna use what is called full count, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All the count. And I'm gonna cross. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do a little two, two jumps to switch the direction, okay? A little hop, to the back. Pa, pa. Yeah? yeah? So we're working on here, we do eight, and we cross. One, Two, three, four, five, six, jump, jump. Tiny, tiny, tiny jump. Okay? okay. At this point, I'm gonna finish here by turning to my left. One, two, three. Tap and to the right. Six, seven, eight. But facing that way. <laughs> eight. Okay, so the right turn is only half a turn because I'm I'm facing the opposite side. So okay. left is full, right is half. Okay, so on five, I'm gonna go forward with the right, and I'm gonna go back to the original position that I was in. So it's five, five six, six, seven, eight. Okay, okay. there's all nine. So I'm on the eight, cross, one, two, three, four, five, six, hop, hop, left, full turn, and right half turn. Okay, so turn it up. It's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. It's a simple right turn, left turn first, Four. and then half of a left turn. Right, uh, turn. right turn, sorry. So left turn one, two, three, tap, okay? And then back to the original line with our half of a right turn. Okay, so from, we will do one from before and then move on to the next count. So from here we did one and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. We we'll count two, three, four, five, six, half, half, full left, two, three, four, half right, six, seven, count. Yes, yes, yes. Count it out loud, okay? There's three different counts in that pattern, okay? So let's do it. Let's do it together. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Back to the You guys are so good. Any questions? No? Very good. All right. So, we're going to continue with the next part of this move. Okay. So, we should do everything from the top up to where we have. Ooh. Okay. okay. Let's remember. Go straight into the step. Here we go. 
Here we go. Count, count for us. Yes? Five, six, seven, count. Go one, two, three, and one, five, and six, seven, and eight. One, and two, and two, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, and eight. One, and two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and four, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Left, two, three, right, six, seven. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is your face in them? Okay. All right, facing you. Five, six, seven, bam. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. One, and two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, and one, and two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and full turn. Half turn. Five, ten. Five, six, seven. Yeah? Very good, you guys. What's okay. Let's One do less. everything with music, yeah? Vamos. <laughs> Instagram, Facebook, Facebook. Yeah. we have a, our page, it's called Rodrigo and Wendy, That's okay, right. Rodrigo and Wendy, okay. and um, on Facebook you can find us on our, our page, Rodrigo and Wendy, our Instagram page also, Rodrigo and Wendy, yes. and we have a YouTube channel, 
that is co, que es one. Rodrigo and Wendy, okay? So. Now, if you want to uh, learn more from us, we do offer classes online, mm -hmm. and we have teams in different cities as well, so you can learn Learning choreography. Mm -hmm. um, choreography is such a good way of training because it really pushes up your level. Plus, when they, um, even if you're in a different city, what we do is we gather all the videos and we give feedback, so yes. you're constantly hearing from us, so it's a really, really good way to bring your level up, okay? Um, we are also wearing our G. Franco G. shoes. G. Franco's. We love G. Franco. Of course. Okay, we've been wearing it for many years. Their shoes are top quality uh, for, for practicing, for classes, for performance. Um, not just shoes, but also they wear. We have our, our teams, they'll have their jackets mm -hmm. um, and performing pants, shirts, and all kinds all of costumes and the jewelry that I use personally for all my performances are from G. Franco as well. So check them out. They're one shop. You get all there, okay? Mm -hmm. You get from shoes to your performing gear or just like your class wear. Like they have everything there, okay? okay. And accessories. Mm -hmm. Good. So we hope you enjoyed the class. Again, Rodrigo and Wendy, check us out on social media and, and let us know if you have any questions or any feedback, okay? Thank Anything you very much. about this video, let us know. Thank okay? you for watching. Thank you, guys. Peace.